Hey guys, welcome back, and if you're new here, welcome. Uh, my name is Kaya, and I'm currently doing my MBA in Luxury Brand Management in AFA Paris, here in Paris. Um, I started this degree in Shanghai, and then I moved to Paris after six months in Shanghai. And today I thought I'll take you with me and show you a full day in my life as a IFA student in Paris. It's a modern art, you don't go to fashion school for nothing after all. <laughs> all of us in front of our house in Shanghai. You take pictures, always take pictures of Eiffel Tower. Or, you know, I'm asking about like online and actually yeah. like. So we're heading to Palace de Tokyo. I kind of tried to attempt to say that before, but vlogging in Metro is freaking awkward. And yeah, it's like a modern. <laughs> It's a modern art museum and it's super popular here in Paris. It's also where Fashion Week happens, or at least some of the shows. Look what we've got right here. Could it be more Paris? Could it be more Paris? I don't think so. Sorry, Kaya, I cannot take you with me. Why? No extra baggage is allowed. Whoa! <laughs> I don't know how much you can see on camera, but look at this. This is like literally a piece of art. How crazy that nature can do that. done at the museum it was enough of art for us uh, and now we're gonna try to find a place where we can get some coffee it's freezing outside oh my god what is he doing Taurus cannot relate after six months in Paris right Nina even if you lived in Paris for six months make sure you take a picture of Eiffel Tower when the opportunity is there always take pictures of Eiffel Tower. I was just thinking in there, I wanted to say that even if you don't study something like connected to creative industries, you should definitely try to make some time to go to like art galleries or art museums because in some way it's just like this weird thing. It just like makes your brain exercise. And it like, I don't know, in some way I always feel like it expands like my creativity or you know, even though it doesn't have it's not like really related should we go down here it's not really like related to like my field or whatever i still like the way it like kind of makes my brain think out of the box taurus always take pictures of eiffel tower we're heading to this very persian looking cafe American Santa Claus? It's not American, he's from Finland, are you crazy? Okay. He's from Laponia. Back in the metro, back in the game. No. He peed? He peed. He no just, way. Yeah, he just like, yeah, I, just, he I was just about to turn the camera. Oh my god, this yeah. is a lovely Parisian metro for you. If you move to Paris, this is what you're gonna have to deal with. too long in Paris, cannot do that too long. So we're heading back to school, we have classes now. Only one class though, so that's good. But one class at IFA is usually like three hours long, not usually, it's always three hours long. So it is quite a bit and then you only get like one break in the middle, so it can get, can get a little intense, especially since classes at IFA are quite small. So in my class we're only 10 people. Um, so yeah, it can get quite intense because you have to like be active all the time and like, you 
it's not like you can sleep in the class because if you're 10 people in the classroom, obviously the teacher can see you. We made it to the hood where Ifa is located and we're gonna grab some lunch from the bakery. It's actually my favorite bakery because once I forgot my wallet and they gave me the sandwich and just told me to come back later. So now I'm like... I know, I love everything that they have. Oh, okay. Look at this. Have a... We're rushing now because we're late. We had a whole day to make it to school. Too late. This is it. We made it. Ifa is literally this building right here. And this is the area. Normally, it's really nice to have like lunch here by the canal when it's warm, obviously. Of an IFA student, that's the video. On. Nail the bum. <laughs> <laughs> make some views. Make yeah, make some views, Anshika. <laughs> Go work the. Charge without shoes. We have art pieces. Sometimes we have food and so on. All this is about references and the people who actually gather to do marathons. Nike. Baby boomers spend time and money on premium pet products. And it comes with the right. We should find a destination. You don't go to fashion school for nothing after all. <laughs> <laughs> you know, listen, you know what happened outside in Paris? Water fell from the sky. Stop it. Yeah, that happened. Oh, Look, you guys. That Look you guys. Look you guys. Oh, it actually looks pretty at night. It's yeah, it's that direction. Okay, okay, okay. We're done with classes and we're heading to dinner. We're gonna have some Indian food in this restaurant that is nearby because we're all dying. Because we've been at school for so long. Or not really that long, but it's kind of late. It's already 8 o'clock. After the class, we had some group meeting and things we had to discuss. So we're all just like <gasps> starving. So, other than guys, okay, we were such a lazy. What does that mean? What I have to do? I have to Google myself this Indian dish because I only have like three freaking Indian people sitting at the table and no one can explain to me what it is. So I have to Google you listen. myself. It's a yellow soup. Get over yellow soup. Oh, thank you. Shana Masala is live, guys. It's live. This is. No, no. This is. No, no. Can I please show this picture? So, this is all of us in front of our house in Shanghai. Needy, the long lost roommate who doesn't exist. Yeah. <laughs> she exists, guys. She exists. But it's all like blurred, so you cannot see. No, but it's like Needy didn't live. Like, Nina. And then Nina. Look at Nina. Oh my god. <laughs> I actually don't look that much better, but still. Yeah. I'm back home. The day is over. It's already 10 p.m. So I'm just gonna get ready and I mean get ready, get ready for bed. Uh, tomorrow we have a full day of classes starting from 9 a.m. So I need to get some rest. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful for those of you that are maybe planning to go to IFA or you're just wondering what my day in Paris is like. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, just let me know and subscribe if you like this video and I will hopefully see you soon. Bye.